My name is M. Narasimha Rao, lecturer in physics. Today, I am explaining one numericals from the waves chapter. A source of a sound is moving with a velocity of 50 meter per second towards the stationary observer. The observer measures the frequency of sound as 500 hedges. The apparent frequency of a sound as heard by the observer when source is moving away from him with the same speed is velocity of sound at room temperature is 350 meter per second. According to the given information, I am drawing one diagram. Now this is the, this is the one road. Here, observer is standing on the road. He is an observer. Observer. Stationary observer. Observer is in a rest. Velocity of observer is equal to zero. They are saying a source of sound is moving with a velocity of 50 meter per second towards the stationary observer. Source of sound I am taking as a train. I am taking as a train. Train is giving the whistle. Train is generating the sound. Train is giving the horn. Train I am calling as a source of a sound. Source of a sound. This source of a sound is moving towards the stationary observer with a velocity of 50 meter per second. This is the source of sound. Velocity of a source is equal to 50 meter per second. Right? Now please listen here. Now, this train is giving the whistle. Train is generating the sound. The sound always travels towards the observer. Sound always travels towards the observer. Velocity of sound is represented by V. V is given as 350 meter per second. Now please listen here. As the train is approaching the stationary observer, train is approaching the stationary observer, apparent frequency, he is listening more frequency, that is the apparent frequency, apparent frequency observed by this observer is 500 hedges. Apparent frequency is given as 500 hedges. Apparent frequency, apparent frequency of dash is equal to 500 hedges. Now, this source is approaching towards the stationary observer. Source is approaching. Towards stationary observer. Stationary observer. Now please listen here. Regarding the Doppler's effect, apparent frequency is given as 
apparent frequency is given as f dash is equal to v minus v naught by v minus v s into f. V represents the velocity of sound. V naught represents the velocity of observer. V s represents the velocity of source of a sound f is the original frequency of the sound original frequency of the sound f dash apparent frequency measured by the observer is given as 500 f dash means 500 v velocity of sound in air that is given as 350 v means 350 minus velocity of observer Observer is in rest, no moment. Velocity of observer is zero. Velocity of observer is zero. Some, when a sound is traveling the right side, source of sound is traveling the right side, both are in same direction. According to sign convention, Vs is positive. By Velocity of sound in air that is 350 minus velocity of source. Velocity of source is a plus 50. Plus 50. F I am writing F. 500 is equals to 350 divided by DD minus into minus into plus minus. 350 minus 50, 300 into F. Now, 57 is 350, 56 is 300, 500 is equal to 7F by 6. It is equation number. It is moving away from the observer with the same speed here velocity of source is 50 here also velocity of source is equal to velocity of source is equal to 50 meter per second now please listen when the train is nothing but it is generating sound it is the source of sound when the train is moving Away from this observer, it is giving the whistle. Whistle means a sound. Sound always travels towards the observer. Sound always travels towards the observer. This is the direction of velocity of sound. Velocity of sound is given as 350 meter per second. Now I am applying the sign convention. Sound wave is traveling left side. Source is moving right side. Both are opposite in direction. For that reason, velocity of source is negative. Observer is in rest position only. Observer is in rest position. As the train, nothing but source of sound, is moving Away from the observer, frequency decreases. The, the, we are calling as the apparent frequency. Now, I am writing when source of a sound, source of a sound is moving, moving away from stationary observer. Stationary observer. Now please listen. Apparent frequency formula when the train, nothing but source of sound is moving away from the observer. Apparent frequency formula. Apparent frequency formula. Apparent frequency formula. F double dash is equal to V minus V naught by V minus V S into F. Now please listen. F is the original frequency of sound. Now original frequency of source of sound does not change. Now please listen. V naught, velocity of observer. Velocity of source. V S means velocity of source. V means velocity of sound. 
f double dash is equal to v v means 350 velocity of sound 350 minus velocity of observer observer is in rest velocity of observer zero v velocity of sound 350 minus velocity of source velocity of source is a minus 50 velocity of source is a minus 50 into f f double dash is equals to 350 minus into minus plus minus into minus plus 350 plus 50 400 into f it is the equation number two they are asking when the train is leaving from the stationary observer what is the apparent frequency that apparent frequency is f dash what is f dash divided by equation one equation two f double dash is equal to 350 by 400 f double dash is equal to 350 by 400 into f divided by divided by equation one equation one 500 is equal to 7f by 6 500 is equal to 7f by 6 now please listen here f double dash is the apparent frequency observed by the observer when this source of sound is moving away from the observer f double dash by 500 is equal to now 57 ja 57 ja 350 58 ja 400 7f by 8 7f by 8 into 7f by 7f by 6 comes to numerator 6 by 7f right 7f 7f cancelled 500 goes to numerator f double dash is equal to 6 by 8 into 500 now please listen 2 3 ja 6 2 4 ja 8 4 1 ja 4 4 125 ja 500 125 into 3 375 f double dash is equal to 375 hedges it is the apparent frequency measured by the observer when source of sound is moving away from the stationary observer